We made sure it's auto flip. Yeah. Back in four. What is it this time, Raven? What is it this time? October is great. So we have actually October and November. We've got two no October boxes. So this is the booklet this month. Survive for October because it was Halloween. First of all, we got you show your shirt. T-shirts. The T-shirt is uh, the e Walking Dead. Not a Walking Dead fan. I watch it, but I know that Andrea dies and the governor dies because they're stupid morons. Are you sure? Because I don't. I know. got confirmation from Facebook today that the governor died, and guess from who? The one who's not for spoilers, but he still did it anyway. So when I replied, I knew it. He was like, uh, he called me as soon as he saw the, my response, and he was like, "Damn it, now I ruined it." Okay. But I ruined it. I'm like, it doesn't matter. I knew it. He's like, but I ruined it. I don't care. And then <laughs> he's like, but I ruined for other people on Facebook, and I hate when people do that, so I just deleted it before anybody else sees it. Good job. But yeah. Shouldn't have said it. You want to see his reaction? He's like, you know what you did, right? You know what you did. The next is the zombie survival guide. It is the book. It is the book. And they this gave made, the book. Yeah, for this is everyone. pretty hefty. This is heavy. It's a really tough. Heavy Top book. ten lessons for surviving a zombie attack. The zombie may be gone, but the threat still lives on. What does that last one mean? That zombie might be gone, but there's still the threat of zombies. Well, it's like yeah, I understand that point of view. Okay. I'm thinking like you kill the zombie, and he's not doing anything anymore. He has beheaded and whatnot. How does the threat still live? Because you don't know if there's another zombie around the corner. I understand. Watch that. Walking Dead. I'm sorry, but that I don't watch it. I was just confused at that, but then you made it clear, as I said earlier. Okay. Next is the Outbreak Status Temporary Tattoo Set from Loot Crate Labs. Oh, well, you had upside down. Oh, sorry. I can't read backwards. You had it upside down. I'm looking at the book. Outbreak Status Temporary Tattoo Set from Loot Crate Labs. You're either a human or you're a zombie. You choose one. So uh, from my our point of view, that's not like disoriented. So I'm like, yeah, I can read what it says. But we can't read what it says here. Yeah, but that because they it's can. a tattoo, Oh man. It's I'm a just so stupid right now. Okay, next is a zombie hunter ID from Loot Crate Labs. So that's the back. It's all the same. And that's the front, yeah. Next is Love Your Guts card from Open Me. And it's a greeting card that you would give to somebody. Love thy guts. It says, I love your guts, Shaven. Love thy guts. That's what's on the inside. So then you have 8-bit zombie buttons from Loot Crate Labs. And... We could see. Yeah. And this is that one. Crossbow. And then the virus. And it's a zombie. A zombie hand. And then the last thing is creepy candy from Candy Candy Warehouse. Bloop. Because it's not only really cool to eat to actually eat people included. Candy versions of their body parts, so you can still live out your dream and be a zombie. They're also delicious. What candy was in this box? There was it's a jelly filled marshmallow candy. And then you have the red eyeball. Box eyes, in my opinion, because man, I'm not a huge zombie person. So now we have the November loot crate. No! I'm not taking <gasps> <what happens. laughs> I got a bubble wrap. 